Hey guys, today I wanna to show you how you can automatically connect your make.com account to your Twitter account via the new Twitter API. It's a little more complex than I initially thought and that it used to be. So I wanna get this tutorial out to help streamline the process for you. All right, so step number one in connecting make.com to Twitter is from within make.com, we're gonna add the Twitter module, just like this. And we're just gonna to connect to the normal Twitter right here. And we're gonna, in this instance, for this example, I wanna create a tweet just to make sure that we have a good, healthy connection between Make and Twitter. So we'll hit create a tweet. Now the problem is I need to add a new Twitter connection. Now in order to add a new Twitter connection, uh, I need a client ID and a client secret. And so in order to get those, we need to go to the Twitter developer portal in step number two and actually set up our own project and app, which will allow us to connect directly to the Twitter API. So let's do that right now. All right, so step number two in linking make.com to your Twitter account is to actually come to the Twitter developer platform page right here, which I will have linked down in the description below. Make sure you're signed into the Twitter account that you wanna post from on another tab. And then we're just gonna come up here and hit developer portal, okay? And so we can see that we're brought to this kind of dashboard page. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna rename my project. So I'm gonna click that and come to settings. And I just wanna name this uh, make.com connection. Okay, and my use case will just be, be making a bot. Uh, and then I'll hit save. Okay, so I just wanna clean this up a little bit. Okay, now the next thing I wanna do is I wanna come here to my projects and apps tab. And I'm gonna come down here to my actual app. Okay, so I wanna come down to my app. And same thing, I'm just gonna rename this make.com Alex app, okay? So that's gonna be the name of my app, just like that. Now what you need to do is, you need to come down from within your app details section, right here, you need to come down here to user authentication settings, and we need to set this up. Now if you wanna build a bot that can automatically tweet for you from make.com in some sort of automation, which is what we wanna do in this video, we're going to actually click read and write and direct message, okay? So we're gonna just enable reading and writing uh, tweets and direct messages right there. I'm gonna select web app, automated app or bot, all right? And then for app info, I'm gonna come over to this link right here from make.com. I will also have this linked down below. And we just need to copy this callback URI or URL right here and paste that here. And then we need a website URL, which will connect this right back to make.com, okay? And so, right now, we are all good to go to save this and we will hit yes. Okay, and once you have that set up, you now have access to your client ID and your client secret, which was the problem back on make.com when connecting to the Twitter app. All right, so now that we have our client ID, we can copy this, come right back to make and paste this in right here. And then we can do the same thing with our client secret. We'll just come copy this right here like that. And we'll hit save. This will launch this window right here. I'll hit yes. I'll hit authorize. And just like that, we have now set up a new connection between make.com and Twitter. So the last step here is we'll just test that this connection is working. And so I'll just say, this was a successful connection between make and Twitter. Okay, I'll hit okay. I'll run this and see if my Twitter account Post that live on my Twitter feed. So I'll come to my Twitter account, I'll refresh, and perfect. We now have a live connection between make.com and Twitter, which we can use to automatically post tweets on our Twitter feed. If you guys like this video, go down and smash that like button for me. I really appreciate it. If you wanna see more videos like this in the future, consider subscribing. I really appreciate all the support you guys have given me over the last few months. It really means the world to me. Thank you guys so, so much for being here, and I'll see you all on next week's video. Peace.